Hi everyone, what's up? Thank you so much for being here. If you guys are new to my channel, hi my name is Jessie and the reason why I don't have any makeup on is because obviously it is my day off. It is actually the last day of my day off and uh, yeah, before I go to bed, I wanted to show to you guys some of the hauls that I have made from the past month. So basically I didn't buy this like an all in one day, like I'm not that rich, okay? So <laughs> we went to... A couple of different stores and it's a part of like my retail therapy just for my own sanity because I can just work 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 and die so sometimes we have to reward ourselves for working so hard in life so this is not something to brag about but just you know I'm just really excited about the stuff that I got so if you guys want to see what's up and uh, yeah just keep on watching I'm literally standing right now because I'm about to show you guys some clothes as well. By the way, I'm so sorry if I give you guys like the lamest intro ever, but anywho, the first item that I wanted to show to you guys is this clock right over here. This is actually more of like a sleeping aid. I can remember when I was young, my dad would, you know, they would buy like a small fountain for the room. Weirdly enough, my dad feels so relaxed whenever he hears the sound of water. So. I'm like the same person. This clock has like different sounds of like when it wakes you up, it gives you the sound of birds chirping, sounds of water, and you can also set a timer if you wanted to sleep. It will give you like different types of sounds, like for example, this. Let me turn that up. The sound of waves. And then the sound of rain, sound of water, it's more of like a water droplet. I love it, John Rain hates it, but I really do love this. And then sound of the ocean, let me turn that off. So you can also choose the sound when you wake up for the alarm clock. So you have the birds chirping. And you have this one, and I feel like I'm in the wilderness every time I hear this. It's really nice. Oh, don't you guys love that? So the reason why I like that when it comes to me waking up is because I feel like if I'm going to be waking up by the alarm of like a crazy sound like ang 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 the quality of my sleep is like gonna be totally ruined so I like it when I wake up with a you know a very light touch of sound not like something that's like banging my brain cells or something like that I don't know if you guys could relate but you know it's not for everybody but to me I love it I just really love it and it will actually give you a light like this it actually reminded me of my vanity light for some reason. <laughs> my selfie light. But anywho, that's that. And the next one that I'm going to show to you guys is the one that I got from Toys R Us. Now, John Ray and I went there. I actually never thought of going there, but everything is 60% off, all out sale, so nothing left behind kind of a thing. So I got two of these. Just a second. Let me get it. So these are just square pillows. Isn't it so cool? So I got two of these. There's only like two left, so I was like, why not? If you guys have any idea of what Toys R Us looks like, it looks like a zombie apocalypse inside the store. I'm not even kidding. Like all of the, the bikes are gone. Everything is just on the floor. I'm gonna try to like insert a clip here somewhere, but yeah, it's it's crazy. It's scary. I feel like there was a zombie invasion when I went inside. People are like going crazy. It's something that I've never really imagined happening. And I also got like two things. John Ray got actually John Ray got like a Nerf gun that he actually uses to me because you know, he loves shooting my butt. But anywho, I got this Hello Kitty bag. Originally, this is $14.99, but I got it half off. So it has like a pouch right over here. This is actually a backpack, which is pretty cool. I don't care what people think. Like, people are going to say like, what the heck, Jesse, you're old. But I don't care, okay? Like, I don't care. Look. 
Look at this, okay? Let me adjust that. Look at that, okay? Like, look how cute. I don't care what people think. I love Hello Kitty. Super cute. I can't. Look at it. Oh, ah, I love it. Okay, I'm going to set that aside. And then you're probably going to laugh at this as well. I got a... <laughs> this is the last one, guys. I don't care if this is for kids. I really don't care. But this is the last thing. And look, the map is here too. I can't. This is so hilarious. Oh. How funny. And then this is $12.99 originally, but of course we got it half off. And look how spacious this is. Okay. Look at that. I'm going to put my makeup here. I don't care. And then this one is actually like too tiny, so I'll probably either extend this or cut it and just probably like hold it from here. But it's super cute. Look at that. It is super cute. So the next item that I will be showing to you guys is this really nice sequin dress. So you can get this at AliExpress. I will be putting the link down below. I just love how beautiful and how really nice this is. This is actually a size small and surprisingly it did fit me. So they do not run like really, really small as you thought it would be. So I'm pretty happy with that. And this is what the back looks like. And of course, I always shop at Q. You guys know this. And this is only $6.99. Don't you just love the details of the shorts? So every time I buy a denim short, I always go like one size larger. Just so because it's hard to fit it in the butt. I'm not saying that I have a big butt. But if you guys are a little curvy like me, then you guys could totally relate. So if it does not fit in the butt, it will fit perfectly on the waist. And if it does not fit the waist, it will fit fit perfectly in the butt so <laughs> so the top is also from q and it's seven dollars and 99 so it's a fun top you know but i don't think i can wear this when my parents are around it's just you know it's not I don't, I don't know where to wear this, like legit. Why this did I even buy this? This top is also from Q and it's $5.99. It's just a basic white tee. And what I like about this one is that it has like a knot in the middle. If you guys know me personally, I love doing this when it comes to my large white t-shirts. It just gives it a little bit of like, you know, like a little hint of style. So I do apologize if I can provide any link for the items from Q is because... Every Q store, the items do vary, but I hope you guys get a chance to grab whatever you see here that you like. So this is $10.99, also from Q as well, and I really love this top. It would be so much better if you use like a tube bra for this one, but I'm too lazy to look for that right now, but I hope you guys get the idea on what this looks like. I have a slight obsession with the color mustard and yellow right now. I don't know why, but um, I think also from the fact that it's in right now. So this is also from Q and it's $10.99. I already have this top in the shade black, but I love the top so much that I have to grab this one. As soon as I saw it, I was like, yes, I have to get this right now. I don't care if I eat ramen for a month. I don't care. I love this top. Very wearable anywhere. I know there's like a plunging neckline, but it's not really going to reveal anything at all. I've tried it. So the next item that I will be showing to you guys is from Fashion 18 District. And I really love this top aside from the fact that this is only six freaking dollars. It's so nice. It looks super cute. It looks super comfy. I just really love this. You know, it's that type of top that will make you look sexy even if it's not showing anything at all. So sometimes if I want to be a little extra or a little bit, if I wanted to make it a little bit more sexy, I'm just going to unbutton usually the first and second and then expose my right or left shoulder then just push it all the way back so nothing is really showing so it's going to look like that
So I have another one from Fashion District 18, and yes, this is also $6. Now, this is actually not my size, but the first time I saw it, I was like, I really have to get this top. It is super fun, and you can do a lot of things with it. You can use it as a cover-up. You can wear it the way you want it to, and it's something that is just so Instagrammable. I just, you know, I think what you can do with this one is that you can just wear a really nice sports bra that you know what i mean like the one that has like a lot of designs and then you can go but yeah i really love this top and i can't wait to wear it just wear a denim short with this one and you're gonna be good to go so this one is from forever 21 like what i mentioned i usually get like a larger size than me because it fits my butt perfectly so this is more of just like a basic pants that is a little faded that I got for $7 because everything is on sale and it's extra additional 50% off. So I was like, you know what? I don't really wear jeans, but these jeans are my right size, right length, and I'm going to get it. So I actually got two of them. So this one is a little bit informal. It has like a lot of rips on it. I think these pants would be perfect for my white shirt or actually any of the tops that I got from the haul as well. So I just really love it. I can remember when I was young, I already have like distressed jeans. But like what I mentioned, I'm always like this girl who wears leggings. But the reason why I bought these is because they do feel like leggings. They're more of like jeggings, I must say. So yeah. So this is the last item for this haul video, guys. And this is my transparent bag that I use on the daily. And I really love this. I actually had a hard time looking for a really nice transparent bag because most of them are flimsy. Now, the reason why I like this one is because how it's made is thick. Like this transparent clear bag is thick. And it also has like a pouch that matches the handle inside. So you can put like, a, like the like the thing over there i'm gonna show you guys okay because i forgot what it's called but you have this thing right over here that you uh, can attach to either this pouch or the clear bag so i love it it's pretty cool it's pretty handy and it's sturdy compared to the other transparent bags that i have so it's what it looks like. I really love it. You can put like a lot of shit inside. That is pretty much it for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think on the comment box down below. And subscribe if you haven't already. Just turn your post notifications on. Sometimes I do upload every day. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.